What's up my beauties? It's your girl Nikki and I'm back with another video, you guys. And I know I've been I've been going on these little missing streaks where I just go missing for a little minute and then I just come back. I am back, you guys, after feels like forever. And I swear to God, y'all, y'all was attacking me in my DMs. Like y'all was going crazy in my DMs. Like, girl, where y'all at? Or I would just post something. Oh my bad. I would just post a little like a little quote or something. And y'all be like, girl, shut the fuck up. Like, is you gonna post a video or not? <laughs> So I came on here. It is currently New Year's Eve. Y'all probably be seeing this video on New Year's. So happy New Year's. But oh, let me sit down. It is currently New Year's Eve. It's actually my mama's birthday. So shout out to my mama. Happy birthday. I love you, girl. You're an amazing person, amazing mom. You that you that be. And you had a queen like me it is. but I really didn't know what I wanted to do as far as this video I just wanted to come on here and talk to y'all basically and kind of let y'all know why I've been missing not exactly why I've been missing because y'all gonna see that video probably like two days from now maybe or tomorrow if I'm feeling like posting every single day but um, I was missing in action for sure. I feel like you know how life just gets overwhelming and with the new year coming, I just wanted to press a reset on a lot of stuff, y'all. This year has taught me so much stuff. Um, in one and I feel like to be honest, I feel like every year is supposed to be a good year, but Every year is a good year when you get past it because, you know, you lived and you you learned and you got to see another day. God bless you with another year. But y'all, 2023, I just feel like was just not the best year for me. I learned a lot, a lot, a lot. Like, um, I didn't do a lot of stuff that I said I want. I did a lot of stuff that I accomplished, a lot of stuff that I said I wanted to accomplish. But at the same time, I feel like I was just not really locked in how I was supposed to be locked in. I played a lot. Um, I kind of took time for granted and took a lot of situations for granted. And you know, I feel like we all have those moments where we just look back on the year and be like, oh my God, like, yeah, I did stuff, but I could have did so much stuff like better. You know what I mean? And it's just a lot of like, I, it's just a lot of stuff I feel like in the beginning, to be honest, the year just started off sucky. Like, the year started off bad, and I should have took that as a sign to just go a different direction. But I kept going in the same direction. I kept doing the same stuff. I kept entertaining and, like, kept entertaining and being around the same people. And it was just kind of toxic and draining on my life. So this new year, I vow to just um, put myself first. I feel like this is a me and my son year. Of course, me and my family. But, you know, I feel like I should be a little bit more selfish. So much stuff has happened behind, like, closed doors that just has made me open my eyes to really realize that, um, you know, I just need to start being a little bit more selfish with my time, being a little bit more selfish with who I place myself around, um, be a little bit more selfish with my heart. I feel like I come off as being so, um, I'm very, very like, uh, what can I say the word is? Um, I'm not as stingy as I should be. Sometimes I come off as like super forgiving or just like, I don't know. Y'all know me. Y'all know my heart. Y'all know I be having a little moments where just be like, you know, be feeling like I be just letting people just do anything or whatever the case may be. But I can definitely say 100% y'all this year was just lessons learned. But y'all already know I don't dwell on anything. I'm super excited to just um, be the best woman I could be 2024. I'm super excited to just 
um, make new goals and accomplish those goals. I already wrote down like a whole bunch of little goals that I have that I want to accomplish in 2024. I've wrote it down. I've prayed on it. I pray over it. And 2024 will be better. And yeah, you already know your girl is turning 25. Y'all, um, my makeup was already, I was getting my makeup done one day and she was like, um, how old are you turning your next birthday? And I was like, I'm turning 25. She was like, oh, your brain is about to fully develop. And at the time, I wasn't really thinking about it, but ever since she said that, it's just really been sticking to me. She was like, 25, you a, a switch gonna click in your head and you just gonna look at everything just so different. You know what I mean? You just gonna, you just gonna like... You gonna look at the world in a different light, and I was like, "Hmm, you might, you might be right about that." You might, you. So I just been thinking about that, and I can't say my mind is just starting to develop and just starting to look at situations completely differently. Even though I feel like I've been pretty mature, I feel like I've been had a good head on my shoulders. You know, you can only grow as a person, and you can only just, you know mature and i'm just really liking the route that i'm going um and yeah so that's been cool but overall just a little life update on me i have been fine mentally i have been 10 times better than what i was before i know like my last q a i was like you know i'm doing okay i'm doing okay but i really can't say that i've just been genuinely happy with the people that surround me genuinely happy with the situations that's going on in my life right now. Um, I've been feeling 10 times more confident within myself about my appearance. Um, and I'll get into all of that later. Cause, But um, I'm just happy. Like my heart is smiling and I'm starting to feel like myself again. And I feel like that's what it's all about. I'm super excited to go into the next year. I'm super excited to turn 25 five i was gonna go out of the country but and i'm still probably going out of the country but i'm gonna have to wait due to some stuff but um other than that y'all um yeah so today is the 31st i sent my mama some flowers let's call her and um tell her happy birthday let's see i'm gonna see if she can I'm going to see if she can talk because she might be opening her gifts. I sent her some stuff for her birthday. I got her these little red, like the matching. Um, I got her the red. She might not answer the phone. But I got her a red bag like mine's. I got this black bag. But I got her a red crunchy bag. And then I got her some red shark boots. And she just loved it. She thought it was so freaking cute. But And then yesterday, I got gifts. I'm going to show you all my gifts. <laughs> I put them on Instagram. But yesterday, this was like my early birthday gifts. And I'm just so happy. So, y'all already know I got these three last year. The the red, um, black, and white from Dwayne last year. And I've added to my collection. And I was gifted more. So now I have a total of five and uh, these are the new ones. This really cute blue one and then this really cute green one and this green one got like a little pattern. It's so fire. That's too cute. That's too cute. And I also got this nice little bag that I wanted to show y'all. It is so cute. I would have did like a little unboxing video. But child. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. But I'll show y'all what it looked like. I got this little cardigan off TikTok shop. Y'all, I've been going crazy on TikTok shop. Like, everything. I've been ordering so much shit. I got this little case off TikTok shop. I've been going crazy on TikTok shop. But look at this cute ass bag. So cute. Way to start the year off. Way to start my birthday, y'all. Look how cute that is. Oh, girl. Get out of here, girl. This match my cardigan a little bit. Hold on, wait. Hold on, wait. Ah! 
Try a little Charlie horse. I gotta close my little thing. Look at that. Girl, this is too fucking cute. But this is my little bag. It's so cute. But I got that yesterday for as my early birthday gift. And I just love it so much. I think it's so cute. Y'all, before New Year's, I got um my cleaning lady to completely clean my house. Like so good and then i just ran through my closet and messed everything up all all over again but um as far as everything else i got you ready yesterday because yesterday was my friend's birthday and then i went to her dinner but this was my first time going out y'all like i literally had this was my first time drinking look how nice and beautiful and clean it is in here but um i literally haven't been drinking at all like whatsoever yesterday was my first time drinking since like a good little minute and i don't know it really was just like i thought i was gonna be a super lightweight but i wasn't i was <laughs> i thought i was gonna be a super lightweight but i wasn't but yeah y'all look how i got these flowers and look how big and beautiful they are and they're literally just sniffing up like it's making the house the whole house smell so good and just so delicious and it's so amazing but yes you guys for the new year um i say just go for everything that um these last two weeks i had a lot of time to just sit and think about what i wanted to do and my plans and my goals and this year i'm just going for everything so i just say go for everything try everything whatever you want to do whatever makes you happy whatever um motivates you at the end of the day whatever puts a smile on your face do it yolo life is so much freaking short Enjoy yourself, have fun, make money, create relationships. Um, and yeah, I really didn't know how much to say in this particular video about a lot of stuff. Um, what I can say is that the reason I wasn't missing is because I went and got surgery. <laughs> so um, that video will be coming very soon. Yes, I did get surgery and I'll explain all the reasons why I did. In my videos, I did vlog the whole entire process. So a lot of times when y'all was DMing me, telling me a whole bunch of stuff, I was actually down and um, going through the whole process of getting surgery. I'm very, very happy with how everything turned out um i will be i'm not gatekeeping anything i'll be telling y'all exactly the whole nine yards so be on the lookout for that don't start with the negative comments just yet just give it a minute and watch the videos and enjoy the content um and yeah super duper excited for the new year um I'm happy. I don't know. I don't know why I keep saying I'm happy. I'm just, I just, I feel like I'm glowing, bitch. But super excited for the new year. Good luck, y'all. Make sure y'all stay prayed up. Um, and yeah, thank you guys so much for supporting me. Um, on all my y'all, literally, I've been doing YouTube since I was 17 years old, and I'm about to be 25 years old, and I'm, I'm just super excited to for a new year and I'm super excited for my birthday. It's cap season in this month. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I just wanted to come on here and say hey, cause I feel like y'all been missing me and I feel like I owed y'all a video and uh, you know, but I'm gonna be explaining the reasons why I was missing and I do have all the content from when I was missing and I'm actually gonna post it so be on the lookout for that. Happy New Year's to everybody. Stay blessed. Thank y'all so much for supporting me, watching my content. 
and watching my videos. I wouldn't be who I am today if it wasn't for y'all, wasn't for y'all DMs and y'all comments and all y'all positive stuff and everything. Um, everything that y'all say, I do take it in and then I do note it. So nothing goes unseen with me. And yeah, happy new year guys. And your bitch is back. Peace. Yeah. Work, 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 work,